Hello guys and welcome back to TechWolf and to this Windows command line course and today we are going to learn another command. In previous video we had a look at copy command and today I'm going to show you even stronger command which is X copy command and this command can do everything the same what copy command can do and it can do even more as I will show you in this video. Let's open a command line by typing in in search cmd and hitting enter. We are again in our users directory let's go to our desktop by typing cd change directory and space and let's go to desktop type in desktop and hit enter and now we are in our desktop and now let's first the similar way as we did with copy command let's copy this file my file.txt and to do that with x copy command type in x copy space and then file name which you would like to copy so our file we want to copy is my file.txt then space and second parameter similar as with simple copy command Command, we need to specify the name of the file we need to specify where we want to copy it and how we want to call this file and I will call this file new file.txt and similar as with copy command when we are using x copy all we are doing we are copying the first file which we want to copy so in first parameter we are using the file or file destination which we want to copy and in second parameter we are specifying the name of that file and this new file.txt will have exactly the same content as this file my file.txt only this will be a new copy of the same file with a different name and hit enter and here it will prompt us that does a new file.txt which we are creating whether if we are assuming to create a directory or file and as this is the file and we are assuming to create a file here we simply specify f and this new file will be created as you can see here and next thing what we can do with x copy command is similar to what we were doing in previous video with copy command is we can copy from one destination to another and let's do it let's copy this new file.txt into this my folder if i click into the my folder you will see that there is currently only one folder which is also empty which is new folder but now let's use x copy command to copy this new file.txt into this my folder and to do that let's type in a command x copy space then first we need to specify a destination and name of the file which we are intending to copy so this is also located here on desktop which is new file.txt so let's type in new file.txt and space and we need to specify where we want to copy it and we want to copy it into my folder so we type my folder backslash and this file name which is new file.txt and hit enter and here's exactly the same it will be asking us does my folder new file.txp specify a file name or a directory and we are also specifying or pretty much telling that we are going we are copying the file not a directory and here we also click on f and it will copy this file into this directory as you can see here now we have new file copied from our desktop into my folder so it's very similar what we were doing with copy command and now if i will click on arrow up on my keyboard to return back to this exit copy command new file.txt here i will change this new file.txt to this my file.txt so i can copy also this my file.txt also into this my folder and let's type instead my file dot txt and we will also copy it into my folder and here at the very end we will give it a different name instead of calling it new file dot txt so these names are different we will call it also here my file dot txt as we are copying now from our desktop my file.txt which is this file on our desktop we are copying it also in my folder as you can see here and we are giving the name my file.txt however you could give any name you want for example instead of my file you could call this file my file 
123.txt if you wish to do so. It doesn't matter what name you are giving to this file as the contents of that file anyway will be the same as this file or first parameter file which you are trying to copy and hit enter and again it will ask whether we are copying file or directory here we simply type in f and this file will be copied and here now you can see that there is my file.txt and new file.txt so as you can see we can do exactly the same as with copy command and similar way as with copy command now let's copy all files from this my folder and let's copy them into this other directory where I have another folder on my desktop which is empty which is called new directory if I will open it up you can see that this is absolutely empty and now from my folder I will copy all these files to this new directory let's open a command prompt let's type in cls to clear this command prompt screen and let's type a command again x copy space and now to copy all files which are in my folder so type in my folder backslash and asterisk sign and to type an asterisk sign click on shift key on your keyboard hold it down and click on it as asterisk sign is about number eight and this is specifying that we want to copy everything what is in my folder and now space and where we want to copy it to we want to copy it to new directory so new directory and hit enter and with this command we copied everything from my folder which is this one to new directory if i open now a new directory you will see the two files have been copied and here you can see that by x copy folders also were fo not copied to this new directory but only files were copied to this new directory as here in my folder if we would copy everything then we would have to copy this folder as well however this folder is not copied and this is exactly as where all capabilities of simple copy command ends as with x copy if you would wish you could also copy all folders and all directories and all subdirectories from one folder to another and to show you how you can do it let's go back to our new directory i will delete these files so let's go to my folder and now let's open a command prompt and let's now copy all files including folders which are in my folder to new directory so now let's clear again with cls command prompt screen type in a command x copy space and then we need to use two switches first one is forward slash s then space forward slash e and forward slash s tells that we want to copy all files and all folders and e tells that we also want to copy all empty directories then space then we need to specify from where we want to copy it so we want to copy it from my folder space and where to we want to copy it we want to copy it to folder which is called new directory so let's type in new directory and hit enter and as you can see See, all files and all folders from this my folder have been copied to new directory x copy command can do exactly the same what we were doing with copy command however with, with copy command you can't copy from one place to another place folders where with x copy you can also copy folders not only files and in next tutorial i'm going to show you even more stronger command for copying files and folders in windows command line <music>